We do. Okay, here we go. A Fox Business alert. The jury in the Elon Musk defamation trial has reached a verdict. Uh, I think we have Elon Musk walking out of the courtroom. He was there. Robert Gray uh, is available to us for the very latest on all this. Do you, do you see him there, Robert? Please don't kick. Go ahead. You're on air, Robert. Looking to see if he's coming out. I understand, David. Thank you. We are waiting for Elon to come down. He is on his way out. He may be taking an alternative exit out. I'm standing off camera so that we could get him in, if indeed he does come out this particular entrance. This is the main entrance to the building, but uh, we're not seeing any of his team coming at just this moment. In fact, I can see through the building a few folks coming out, but in case you didn't read that verdict, David, on the way in, they found in Musk's favor. So they, did, they uh, found in favor of the defendant. So Musk found uh, not guilty of defaming uh, Vernon Unsworth, the British diver, uh, from that uh, Thai rescue case, uh, the, the pedo guy tweet. That, right. uh, that Mr. Musk had uh, tweeted out. And he, in fact, told our producer, Elka Warner, on his way down into the elevator, he said that my faith in humanity has been restored. And that was all he would say. And then he got into the elevator. And, and uh, we're waiting to see if he's going to come Robert, out. Robert, as we again, await his, uh, his favor. As we await his appearance, yeah. just for the viewers who don't know, was was his defense or, or his, his point based on the First Amendment that, uh, look, you can say what you want according to the First Amendment. Did he lean on that in order to win his point? It, 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 it really was not. Uh, his defense attorney basically just framing it as insults between two people that were very publicly made. And this obviously is kind of groundbreaking in a lot of ways, David, because there have not been a lot of high profile cases like this where you have a very public person and someone who's been ruled a private person. In Mr. Unsworth's case, the judge had ruled that he was a private person. Um, so we were waiting to see whether or not Twitter would be you know, held to the same standards as, say, uh, a newspaper or magazine would be if, if this uh, type of... Uh, you know, accusations or, in this case, uh, insults were published. So we were waiting to see that. Um, basically, he was saying that they, that uh, in his closing arguments, the attorney for Musk saying that Unsworth should, quote, stop monetizing the kids in the cave, meaning the soccer team that was he led the rescue of and was part of that rescue team, and he should stop monetizing lawsuits. So okay. basically framing up Mr. Unsworth as someone who was not damaged, especially to the tune of the 190 million bucks that his uh, attorneys were seeking from.